This week is all about gratitude and showing my staff appreciation. I went onto Facebook and I took really professional headshots of them smiling and wrote a story about them and complimented them and put it on my Facebook. And it's awesome. So you've got to show appreciation to employees. So how do I do that? Well, today it's uh, my staff member Erica's birthday. She's an awesome technician for me and did something a little different than I've done. What did I do? Check it out. <laughs> did a little birthday surprise over here. So, you know, it's not that hard to please staff members. You got to show them that you care. You gotta show them that you show up for them every single day, even if you're not in the office, even if you're on vacation. Respond to your emails, respond to your texts, sh compliment them, and be there. That's it, you know? Do something a little extra special, do something different. A lot of you, you know, might have boring personalities in the practice. I mean, this is some silly stuff I did here. I just freaking went to the dollar store and decorated someone's car, gave them some birthday balloons. Uh, Debbie, my front desk receptionist, made a cake. And that's super meaningful. And, you know, we kind of had fun, uh, you know, just being stupid. And that's what I call showing appreciation for staff. Check this fly swatter out. Hey, pretty cool, huh? So let me give you a little rundown of what happened when she saw the car. I'm going to show you. All right, I'm in the back of the office now, and most of my staff, we all eat lunch outside together because we enjoy getting the sunshine. It's really good bonding, and we all need vitamin D. That's a strategy for you, too. If you want to bring happiness into the office, get a picnic table and eat outside with your staff. Even management needs to be there. All right, so walk outside. Here we are outside of the Brillai Center building, and boom. What do you know? She walks outside. She's got her own little reserve parking space, and... A birthday surprise. You know, everything in, at work should not be predictable because predictability is boring, all right? So, show people that you care, show gratitude, remember the birthdays, anniversaries, dogs' birthdays, deaths, whatever it might be. Show them that you care a damn, damn lot. Do something different, guys, come on. Oh, by the way, this is my picnic table. I'm actually gonna put a little garden right here pretty soon. Uh, be a nice, cool little spot. Anyways, gonna go over a few more key points about how to show gratitude. You know, a few ways you can show gratitude is by letting people have responsibility, give it to them. So I've been doing a lot of the frame purchasing for the past six years, but you know what? I'm over it. I've mastered it. I know what the fashion trends are that I like and my patients aren't digging and I'm just gonna give it up. I'm gonna give direction and power to somebody else now that is showing gratitude, showing that you care, developing new skill sets every freaking week. Show some gratitude by letting someone go home when they wanna go home. Have a little flexibility in your work schedule, guys, you know? Look, I'll tell you what. You know, sometimes I know my staff wants to go home and that's when you take the last patient. It feels good. Just tell yourself, hey, you can go home, I got the last patient. Even if you're coworkers, you guys need to work together to, to show gratitude, show them that you care. All right, I wanna talk about compliments and praise. Um, you know, I'm not the best at complimenting people sometimes, and you know, that's just not my personality. You know, I like to show gratitude in other ways. You know, sometimes just a, you know, a pat on the back is just, it's just not enough. So, uh, you know, I like surprises, that's me. I'm an unpredictable guy. I wanna surprise people with stuff. That is cool, okay? One thing I did once, I had a staff member, she was just crushing her job, technician, doing a really good job. I went on to Amazon and I purchased like $30 worth of goods. I had like peanut butter and these uh, face masks that these you guys women like to buy and shipped them to her house. They arrived at her apartment, her boyfriend was there. I was like, whoa, did we get a package? No, it was me. I shipped Amazon products. It was gratitude. It was a surprise. We all want to have surprises in life. So those are a few ways that you can show gratitude every single day. Do it. You can do it. Be smart. Be thoughtful. 
celebrate birthdays, show gratitude, have a good staff, be a good manager, be a good go co-worker. Life's not about top-down and management pleasing everybody. Co-workers need to please everybody, management needs to please everybody. We all have to be a team. Show gratitude, be a team, have fun, go to work, love of Tom Street, love of Tishery. Peace.